freedom is the one purport, wisely or unwisely, professed of all the important movements of our time. It is through the state that spiritual value first comes into being, and it is through the state that it is maintained in being. The worth of a state in the long run is the worth of the individuals composing it. Human consciousness postulates liberty, and in this degree and to this extent, liberty postulates itself. Rights are the most precious of all possessions. Thomas Hill Green, fondly known as T.H. Green, was more than just a philosopher. He was a social reformer, an educator, and a passionate advocate for individual liberty and social justice. Born in 1836, his life traversed a period of profound societal and intellectual shifts, leaving a lasting legacy that continues to resonate today. Early Life and Intellectual Awakening Born into a Quaker family in Yorkshire, Green's early life was marked by intellectual curiosity and a strong moral compass. He excelled in his studies, attending rugby school and later Balliol College, Oxford. It was there that he encountered the ideas of philosophers like Immanuel Kant and John Henry Newman, igniting in him a lifelong passion for understanding the relationship between individual consciousness and the broader world. Shaping a Philosophical Framework Green's early career saw him navigate different academic positions while refining his philosophical ideas. He was appointed to a fellowship at Oxford in 1859, immersing himself in the vibrant intellectual scene and developing his signature brand of idealism. This philosophy emphasized the interconnectedness of individual minds and the existence of an ultimate reality beyond the material world. Beyond the Ivory Tower, education and social reform. Green's commitment to the practical application of philosophy led him to take on the role of tutor and later principal of St. Mary's Hall in Oxford. He believed that education should not be confined to the elite but should be accessible to all, fostering critical thinking skills and a sense of social responsibility. He actively campaigned for educational reform, advocating for greater access to universities and the inclusion of women in higher education. A beacon of liberalism in a conservative era. Green's intellectual stature grew as he published influential works like Prolegomena to Ethics and The Principles of Political Obligation. He became a leading figure in British idealism and a vocal critic of the laissez-faire capitalism that dominated the Victorian era. He argued for a more equitable society, advocating for greater state intervention in social welfare and the protection of individual rights. Green's social activism extended beyond his writings. He co-founded the Oxford Liberal Club, a platform for discussing and promoting political reform. He spoke out against inequality and injustice, championing the rights of workers and advocating for social policies that would improve the lives of the marginalized. Legacy of a Visionary Thinker Green's untimely death in 1882 cut short a brilliant career. However, his legacy continues to inspire philosophers, educators, and social reformers alike. His contributions include a robust philosophical system. Green's idealism offered an alternative to the dominant utilitarian and materialist philosophies of his time, emphasizing the importance of individual consciousness and moral responsibility. A commitment to social justice. Green's activism and writings challenged the status quo and advocated for a more just and equitable society, paving the way for future social reforms. A dedication to education. Green's belief in the transformative power of education continues to inspire educators and policymakers to create learning environments that nurture critical thinking and social responsibility. T.H. Green's life and work offer a testament to the power of intellectual inquiry, social engagement, and unwavering commitment to justice. 
he reminds us that philosophy is not merely an academic pursuit, but a vital tool for understanding ourselves, our society, and our place in the world. By embracing Green's legacy, we can continue to navigate the complexities of our own time and strive for a more just and equitable future for all.